Greetings viewers, today I'm gonna tell you a story, it begins with a young man, meet Mr. Rosedin. This is a story about his journey of becoming a successful entrepreneur. As a young motivated man, Mr. Rosedin traveled all the way to the States, leaving his home and family to attain his degree in mechanical engineering. He flew back home to Malaysia after completing his degree and attained his first job. First and only, I might add. Oh no, not because he wasn't good, but because he was extremely good. He was put in different departments where he gained experience and knowledge of a vast variety. Mr. Rosedin was then sent to South Africa under Petronas where someone with his enthusiasm and motivation got bored. He was unsatisfied and urged for more. His hunger for something more led him to leave the country of Safaris and return to good old Malaysia. And indeed, that turned out to be a great move as opportunity knocked on his door. Rob Tex and Juan Berhard was going through a rough patch and Mr. Rosedin's friend the owner of RockTech asked Mr. Rosedin to buy the shares. Since the shares were cheap, Mr. Rosedin decided to purchase majority and the other shareholders trusted him to run the company fully as he had 20 years of experience in the industry, technical, managerial and financial. He also recognized that RockTech was the only company offering the facility meeting all five points of recognizing opportunity. But this opportunity did not come cheap. For finances, Mr. Rosedin visited his friends, Taraju, a government funding program, trips to the bank and a lot of his own personal savings, after which he finally had enough money to finance Rope Since his time started at Rope Tech, Mr. Rosedin planned and managed growth successfully and RopeTech expanded internationally to Labuan, Brunei, Philippines and Myanmar. But each move was strategically planned. Mr. Rosedin practices planning strategically almost religiously. He meets with his general manager, accountants and so on on a daily basis and ensure those plans are being met. The daily challenges of his new job keep him excited for each day. And he does not want to stop here. With many more projects ahead, RopeTech is continuously climbing the success ladder. With this, my friend, Mr. Rosedin found contentment. And alas, Mr. Rosedale, a successful entrepreneur, lived happily ever after. Yeah. Yeah.